I'm going to show you how to use straight lines to shade your artwork using the blend tool in Adobe Illustrator. I want to add some shading to his legs. So what I've done is I've isolated the areas that I want to shade with this red color and I'm going to make them a compound path. So to do that, select both of the objects, press command or control eight. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create two paths. I'm going to make sure these paths are long enough to cover the entire width of the area that we're applying this to and make the second stroke down kind of towards the bottom wherever the end of the shading is going to be. Wherever the beginning of your shading, the darkest point is, you're going to want to make that path the biggest. Next, I'm going to select the blend tool and I'm just going to click on both of these paths one at a time. By default, it's going to add a lot of lines in there. So I'm going to double click on the blend tool over here, change it from smooth color to specified steps and change this number down to something lower. I do like how this looks and I'm going to hit OK. Last step, I'm going to take the area that I'm shading and I'm going to move it all the way up to the top and we're going to create a clipping mask with our blend object. Do this by selecting that compound path, select the lines below it and press Command 7 or Control 7. This is going to isolate them to that area and you have now shaded your legs with straight lines. Hopefully this was helpful and you can think of some ways to experiment with this shading style in your own design or artwork. If you like what you see, be sure to stick around.